Dave Bryan here with you today. This has got to be one of the prettiest days in Houston, Texas in months. It's sunny. There's not a cloud in the sky. About 75 degrees. I think it's time for a little road trip with the wife and kids. Let's see how this works. <laughs> So we drove out to Washington on the Brazos State Historic Park. We've been here many times before. Uh, the dogs love it here. They've got a pretty good run. Uh, not a lot of people here, so it's always a good place to take them where there's not too many hassles or anything. But. The view in front of you here is looking towards the park from the other side of the Brazos River. Uh, we're facing west right now. In the distance you can see some of the buildings in the park. Uh, they've added a gift shop as well as a maintenance shed. And yeah, my wife is eyeing the gift shop for later on. here to this park. I'm going to guess about four or five years. And in that time they have made some improvements such as that amphitheater down below. And like I mentioned earlier there's a gift shop and over there in the upper right corner is the oldest building in the park. It's a museum and I've got company as usual. I love my flying feathered friends. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because it's only about an hour and a half from the house, this has been always one of our favorite places to come to. But yeah, this is a nice place to visit. It's usually always pretty quiet because it's, it's educational. And in that, uh, kids don't really come here to play too much, they come here to learn. <laughs> so they don't come here too often just for fun, which is a shame, I guess, because this really is a beautiful place. Scenic, quiet. Tons of pecan trees, and right now, at this time of year, there's plenty of pecans to be had off the ground. Just ask my wife. She spent most of the day breaking her back getting them. But yeah, this, this is a nice place. This 
This area that I'm over right now is called Barrington Farms. This is a, an educational farm where a lot of, I guess, uh, classes will go to to learn how life on a Texas farm was around 100 to 150 years ago.